Hi, this is a tutorial about how to get WhatsApp working on your Android tablet. Uh, of course, you will need an Android phone that's rooted, and you will have to install Titanium Backup, and you will need uh, an Android tablet that's also rooted with Titanium Backup, and you will need uh, some File Explorer like ES File Explorer. Um, the procedure is simply by backing up your uh, WhatsApp data uh, from your phone and then restoring it uh, on your Android tablet. I will go through the whole procedure. It's easy. Go to Titanium Backup. Go all the way down to WhatsApp. Here it is. Back it up. And then click here. Go to the right and then send the latest backup. Use this option, the separate files, because uh, I tried the easy import me uh, method and for some reason didn't work. So send the app plus data separate files. You can send it using Gmail. Uh, I have already sent the email, so I will go to the tablet. Okay. Now get the tablet, um, again uh, on Gmail you can't actually uh, download the files here so you will have to go to the browser and then go to Gmail <coughs> and okay here are the files download the first file oops download it twice no only once download the second file start it downloading download the third file and did it download it should download it one two no download the third file okay here we go okay so now that you have downloaded the three files uh, you can use ES file explorer for example it's free go to uh, the file explorer go to the to the download folder you will find the three files you have downloaded and then let's select them and then operations move to and then select the titanium backup folder okay now that they have moved over there go to the titanium backup uh, app and then backup and restore you should find what's up by the end of the list yep here it is and then restore the backup huh, I have to anyway restore the backup restore add plus data here we go and here it is here is the whatsapp application on your android the thing is though I have to mention that uh, you should remove it from your uh, Android phone because uh, if you have both applications running uh, messaging uh, messages will get to one of the uh, devices you won't get both messages if the tablet is connected and the phone is not you'll get messages here and not on the phone if your tablet is connected uh, in your house for example and you have your phone outside your tablet will get the messages but you won't have any messages on your phone so you should have only one app running uh, that was confusing for me in the beginning that's why i have to remind you about that and that's all if you have any questions oh what's wrong focus okay if you have any questions uh, you can just ask me and that's it good luck